I start to understand if she is understanding and moving with me. Do I have her following my motion? If she's echoing the motion that I do, if she does, I start to surprise her more so her nervous system adjusts to new movement, the new qualities. If she has that, then I start to take her into space and I slow down again, lower, try to go lower, lower and up again. And then I take her a little bit into space, soft, but strong inside so she's able to echo whatever ideas I propose. And I let her so lower and we go. Mm. Now it's your tongue. Another foot slower. Foot one shoulder. Second shoulder. Chest uh, softer. So first is axis. Do I have her in axis? Does she understand what she's doing above her feet? Yes, she does. Now she feels super comfortable. From this place, so I see, I feel her imaginary axis. And around that axis, I'm playing with her head, her ribcage, her pelvis, and her feet. Waving. Taking one shoulder, ribcage. Other shoulder, ribcage. Oh, which body part wants to be involved and which body part is on the sleeve? So you can trace quite easily what will be the future injury probably of a partner. Older, and she has to give me an echo response in the rest of her structure. First on both feet. Come on both, Linda. Come closer with your feet, even closer. This is number one. Now on one foot. very functional when you have a problem, when you have injuries or you are overcoming injuries in your body, as well for dancing and everything, of course, and movement. There's this magical connection.